now, people living in the tent city are packing their bags. They have less than five hours to leave because of a rat infestation. Fox 46 is Robin Kennedy live outside tent city. I know you've spoken with people uh, today, but also throughout the week, Robin. What are they saying now? Yeah, Paige, it does not appear that even though there is an order to vacate this property here by 5 p.m. today, that people will actually be out of here. There are still a lot of tents up in the area. But if you look this way, you can see that some of the tents look like they've been taken down. There's some trash piled up around here. Now, I want to show you some video. That government center now where five people were out protesting Mecklenburg County's order to vacate tent city because of the rat infestation. One of the signs said homes for neighbors, not hotels for strangers. One of the protesters who has visited tent city is reacting to the fact that it doesn't appear CMPD or the Mecklenburg County Sheriff's Office is going to enforce the order to vacate. I feel good about that, them not enforcing, um, you know, and giving them more time. But at the same time, it's still an issue. It's still a homeless issue that needs to be resolved. Everybody is not going to the hotels or the shelters. Now, yesterday, CMPD put out a statement saying they are not going to, quote, criminalize homelessness when this order to vacate is issued today at 5. They say that if property owners make complaints about trespassing, they will arrest people. And the Mecklenburg County Sheriff says he has not gotten a clear plan from the county on exactly how they want him to enforce this order and just no clear plan at all from them, according to the sheriff. So lots still up in the air about what law enforcement will actually do come 5 p.m. today. I'm live at Tent City, Robin Kennedy, Fox 46.